Boy, Have you seen Apple some of those crazy videos? What is oh, is this for the people Xbox who have one the Boy? But like the Xbox One does not. Oh yeah, the separate Pit Boy app. I wish I could figure. I wonder how that works. But yeah, it turned out the Pit Boy app actually leaked a lot of info. Oh man, actor fade and objective fade are all the way up. General subtitles are on. Dialogue subtitles hey. on. Yep, subtitles everywhere. Um, we are gonna have to go without music for a while. Or pretty much all of it. Why? Well, we kind of want to share this on YouTube. Yeah, it's kind of stupid. Also, is survival... Do we know if survival is absolutely... Survival right? is bullet sponge mode. I actually have no idea how hard it's supposed to be. I don't intend to play that survival hard. Survival level also dramatically slows the rate of healing. Like, there's survival and very hard. I, I don't know what the difference is between the two. I'll see if anyone's written a, uh, well, it's, well, it's been three days since it went out to the public. Because Germany. Oh, it's been three days? Really? Germany got it, to, or got it uh, Friday night. Oh, wow. Oh, because of, like, GameStop and everything? No, because Germany just got it early. Okay, whatever. All right, yes. so yeah, we're gonna play this on survival. And here it might we be go. the hardcore vote. I don't know. Apparently, it took someone like ten <laughs> minutes to beat the Deathclaw. Start a new game. First one, anyway. Obviously. All right, no talking. Oh, right. <laughs> oh, I was going to say, did you turn off God Rays? I don't know what that is, and I didn't see it in the options. All right, load whenever you want to, Fallout 4. Hey, at least you're playing. War. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. 
for my wife, for my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. Never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hun. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. All right, guys. Let's see. This is usually the funnest part about Fallout. See you in four hours when you're done making your character. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right, Dexy? Spend four hours trying to figure out exactly what you want. And then? And then? Wait, is that a hair follicle out of place? Nuke, start <laughs> over. Uh, be woman in background. Seeing dude change to every possible combination of race, color tone, <laughs> shape of the head, shape of hair. Try keeping a straight face, trying not to panic. Wait a minute. Color. We want... Hmm. Markings, blemishes, damage. War. War never changes. Yeah. I want to, like, change hair and stuff. Body? And eh, average. I mean... Bam, we're large, thin, or outrageously like ripped for no reason. Wow. <laughs> hey, stop hogging the mirror, hon. Let me look. Let's say what are you gonna make a really short, really skinny and short armed but massive barrel chest dude? <laughs> like you can do an arm. There are ways to die and there are ways to die. Um I wanna mess with your hair, dude. You know what? I I'm not even gonna worry about it at this point. We can't figure that, that option hair. out. Hey, hon. I'm hurrying up. Don't worry. The old post. Way of the future. Okay. What the hell's that? It's a neat little thing there. Mr. Handy. Ah, good morning, sir. Your coffee. 173.5 degree Fahrenheit. Ruled to perfection. And today's newspaper just delivered. Thanks, Kazuwa. Of course, sir. Uh oh, sugar bombs. Breakfast cereal. Aww. Enjoy your coffee, sir. Grognak the Barbarian in the Jungle of the Bad Babies. My favorite. Now, oh, sounds like someone may be sticky. I shall attend to young Shaw. You know, I was nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Shaw. Shit. Huh. With future TVs 
don't look like. That's good to hear, Evan Bomb. Let's try and go look at our son. Can you get that? It's probably that salesman. He comes for you every day. Don't worry about the dishes. That's my job. Okay. Uh oh. Good morning. Voltec calling. Good morning. Isn't it? Just look at that sky out there. <clears throat> you can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. What's so important? Why, nothing less than your entire future. If you haven't noticed, sir, this country has gone to heck in a handbasket. If you'll excuse my language, the big kaboom is... It's inevitable, I'm afraid, and coming sooner than you may think, if you catch my meaning. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a, um, a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault. One eleven. Sounds great. Oh, it is. Believe you me. Now, you're already cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of uh, total atomic annihilation. <laughs> I just need to verify some information. That's all. Tell me more about this vault. Oh, it has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Not to mention total protection from nuclear radiation and hostile mutants. A better future underground. It's not only our mission, it's our passion. Sure, let's do it. Splendid. Splendid. Now, uh, <clears throat> let's see. All right, here we go, ladies and gents. Let's see. We want to be... <sighs> oh. Want to be... One points. Oh, yeah. yeah, that makes sense. I can't math. We want to be highly intelligent... From what I heard, intelligence got nerfed as hell. Intelligence is a measure of your overall mental acuity and affects the number of your experience points earned. Really? Okay, I heard that the amount, that the percentage amount for intelligence got nerfed. <laughs> let's see. A strength is a measure of your raw physical power. It affects how much you can carry and the damage of all melee attacks. Perception. In your environmental awareness and sixth sense, and affects weapon accuracy in bats. Endurance, measure of your overall physical fitness. It affects your total health and the action point drain from sprinting. Charisma, your ability to charm and convince others. It affects your success to persuade in dialogue and prices when you barter. Okay. Obviously, we saw Intel, measure of your overall mental acuity, and affects the number of experience points earned. 